Okay guys, so I opened up Doctor on Demand app and I signed up and this is one of the first screens. So does your employer help cover Doctor on Demand the visits from those employers partner directly with Doctor on Demand to provide benefits to their employees? Since I am not part of this, I'm just gonna go, I'm not sure. And they do want you to put your employer. I'll just skip for now. Okay, so hi cat, what's next? So you can see a medical doctor now. Can't wait time one minute. Book an account appointment and then pick your pharmacy. Explore the app. So let's explore the app. Alright, so we got a whole new screen activity right here. Home get care. My health, which is basically a personal health record. Um, medical, our doctors can treat hundreds of issues, including sinus infections, get care. So if you click on this, I believe you're going to be here. Anyways, next. Mental health. Uh huh. They will take care of depressions and anxiety, workplace stress. So they have the, um, the sliding deck over here. And then... What to expect in your first visit, how it works, with the doctors, there's a list of testimony. And I think this is about epidemia or something, so the flu doctors are in. So let's see this one. Um, it brings you to YouTube embedded to the app. Okay. A video visit with the doctor, how does it work? Hi, this is Dr. Tong with Dr. On Demand. Hi, Dr. Tong. I'm Leah. The last time I took my temperature, it was 101.4. You're playing with a plastic bat, and the bat must have hit his nose, and out goes the blood. Is this the first time you're ever talking to a therapist? Yeah, I mean, it's the first time I've, I've done it. 18 years ago, I went into medicine to help people with their emotional health, and this makes it easier to do that. I want to feel like it's not chaos. Yeah. I want to feel like I have a choice. Of the top 20 problems that patients go into the ER urgent care for, probably 18 out of that 20 could be treated through our model of Doctor On Demand. Yeah, do you feel it's anything there? Thing. Yeah, there's a little bit of a pool here. Hi, how are you, Nassim? <laughs> Often I use Keflex, so we'll get that prescription called into the pharmacy for you. And you should be able to pick that up within 30 minutes. That's amazing. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> It's not about me fighting through this insanity of the medical system. This is fantastic. If you have any other questions or concerns, please don't hesitate to call us back. Thank you, doctor. Bye-bye. Thanks for calling Doctor On Demand. Have a good day. Impressive. All right, so this is something embedded in the app. Okay. And let's see what else we can do here. For example, let's get care. See first available board certified doctors. Okay, we need some information to give you the best care. Your visit with doctor only costs seventy five dollars, and you can apply a coupon. Interesting. So they have coupons, and then I just put an alias for my protection. And yes, there's your employer, and then we go back to the original screen. And then when you book a medical visit, let's go. And then again, for example, my child, you put stuff in here with the idea that I'm legally authorized to make medical decisions for this individual. Professional, so they have a disclaimer, that's good. How about someone else? If you're doing it for someone else, that person has to have their own account. Perfect. All right, so book a mental health session. Again, same plan. And there's a disclaimer right here there's a crisis or emergency all right so this is basically the get care with mental health embedded so if you click on get care of mental health here again you go back to the um, previous activity of the account all right so how about this one see all of our doctors meet the providers introduction so there's text over here regarding the telemedicine platform and then the physicians that are actually part of the team all right and psychologists and psychiatrists okay so there's a list 
and then screening and training i would say screen train our providers so they are actually uh, part of a closed net membership apparently and then physicians they tell you exactly how they train the people the clinicians to use the platform and how the quality management is uh, taken care of by the platform company and then the quality and oversight peer reviews many so here it's basically collaborative nature of feedback and quality improvement so they tell you exactly what they do let's click on this one a video visit with the doctor okay how does that work huh? video in the same area okay so how about this one for the epidemia learn more all right so when you click on learn more you are pushed into medium so it's embedded there's an api for medium.com and they give you more information so it's text information all right and what else what is, what else in there um let's see the settings so that settings has payment method, so you have uh, transactions, fiscal transaction, um, security reason, got fingerprint for login, and employer, insurance, yeah, you have to add your insurance, then again, your employer, and your contact information, email, password, and then payment method, obviously, let's click on that, so you scan card or put your card. Okay, and then you can share doctor's demand so that you can have perhaps some promo code. You can get $10 off the first visit. It's a very good business model. All right, so basically that's all there is here, I believe. My care as we have seen it, and then my health. How many visits have I done? What are the documents? Maybe upload some documents. And then some messages, perhaps, ask a new question. Can I choose my doctor, add a photo, something. This is for the support team of the, of the web app, of the app, and then lab orders. So if the, the doctor requires some lab work, you can put it here. It's very, very remote, actually, very nice. Uh, my favorite provider, you have not added any favorite providers, and then pharmacies. You can add a pharmacy so you can look for search for for a pharmacy near me that's very good very impressive even the usability is um, well done actually uh, how do i rate it i would say five over five for the current version 3.0 five over five amazing